Hi there, Year 9. Welcome to this video on proportion. So what we're looking for you to do is to uh, watch the video carefully, pause the video when prompted, and copy the examples into your book. And then you can try the questions on the worksheet. Okay, let's take a look at the first example. So suppose Daisy earns £40 in 8 hours. How much does she earn in 3 hours? And we can tackle this problem very much the same way we tackled our ratio problems. So we can say in 8 hours, Daisy earns £40. So we can set up a box like so. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8. So over the course of 8 hours, she makes she makes 40 pounds so i should be able to work out how much she earns in one hour by doing 40 pounds divided by eight so in other words i'm asking myself what number can i put in these boxes so that it's all the same and that they add up to 40. well 40 pounds divided by eight is five pounds so what we can say is each hour Daisy is making five pounds and we can double check that by ensuring that the total number from all these boxes adds up to five pounds How much does she earn in three hours? Well, we've got one, two, three lots of five. So three times five pounds gives us 15 pounds. So Daisy earns 15 pounds in three hours. Okay, let's have a look at the second example. So suppose Tyler cycles three hours, or three miles in 21 minutes, how long does it take him to cycle five miles? And we're assuming here that Tyler can maintain his speed and doesn't get tired when he's cycling. So we can set up the problem very similar to the way we did the last one. So we've got three miles in 21 minutes. So we can say this is 21 minutes in total. And that's three miles. So I'm going to divide my rectangle into three boxes. Right, so we got 21 minutes, th three miles. Okay, how long does it take him to, or how, how long does it take to cycle one mile? So if I do 21 minutes and I divide that by 3 because we should have the same number in each box and the total from these three boxes here must add up to 21 and 21 divided by 3 is 7 minutes so seven minutes in each box I should now be able to work out how long it takes him to cycle five miles well each mile is seven minutes so if I do seven minutes and I multiply that by five seven times five is thirty five minutes okay uh, just another point to note um, another way you could have done this is well we know um, 21 minutes is three miles and I can see from the diagram here that another two minutes will be 14 uh, another two miles will be 14 minutes well I could just do 21 minutes plus the 14 minutes remember that represents three miles 
3 miles and this is 2 miles and if we add them together we should get the 5 miles 21 and 14 is 35 minutes and 3 miles and 2 miles is the same as 5 miles okay and that's the video on proportion done uh, you should now be able to attempt the exercises provided to you that's all from me hope you hopefully you enjoyed the video i'll talk to you again sometime take it easy